Hello YouTube, I'm David with the David West channel. A subscriber, Jack P383, wanted me to take a look at these $3 bait knives that Walmart has. I told them I'd look at it, maybe do a review. Oh, here's one that doesn't have a tie wrap on it. <laughs> Look at the angle of that blade coming out of that handle. But that is sort of a Mora type handle. Mora type sheath. That handle feels great. Rubberized. What does the grind look like? Looks like a little wider grind on this side than on this side. Yeah, look up at the point. Very little grind like there is on this side. I could touch up all that. I don't like that this hilt down here is not sharpened. Let's go ahead and get one. We'll take it home and sharpen it up, the edge and the spine, and give it a good try out. I'm not gonna baton with this thing. You know that handle's not gonna be able to take batoning. That tang probably doesn't come down in there two inches. If you want your own $3 bait knife, they're over here on the aisle where the fishing rods are at. All right, I will say that I do like this type of a sheath. It just clips right onto your pocket. I love that. And the barcode has got to go. And cut the tie wrap. Looks like they got an even grind on this one. You know, except for up at the tip. If this knife is worth working on, I might make a more even grind up at the tip. But for right now, let's see how sharp it is. No, there's no need to even try to cut paper with that. All right. And these are my Smith's sharpening stones. They are $20 at Home Depot. And I brought both of them out because this is my older stone. And if I had to work on that grind to make it even all the way on one side, this is the stone that I wanted to use, that coarse side. I sort of want to keep this newer one pristine if I can. Let me show you that it comes with a sharp spine. But we can do better than that. Present that spine at 90 degrees to this coarse stone and give it about 10 passes and then feel for that burr. That's way better. I 
I don't know what you'll be able to see, but it is razor sharp. The spine is sharper than what it was. Now there's a burr on it. Let's cut some paper first. Try to stay in front of the wind. That's not bad for a bait knife, is it? Keychain ferrite, it's a bayite. Scrape some fat wood. Like butter. That is a plenty good enough knife for your tackle box. And if you have to make fire with it, as you see, it'll, it'll work nicely. Let me show you my scrapings and shavings. It did a very good job on the shavings, scrapings, and fatwood stick. Let's go ahead and fire them up. All right, put the shavings in there first. Fire up the scrapings. And I put the fat wood stick on top of it. All right, y'all, do me a favor. Before you leave my channel, please subscribe, hit the notification bell, and in that drop down list, select all. And do give the video a like. I appreciate you joining me on this one. We'll catch you on the next one.